I just made a couple of fun little mind teaser puzzles. Some projects are fun because they're really big, and others are fun because they're small. Uh, these are great. You can pick up everything you need to make these uh, mind teaser puzzles at your local hardware store or farm store. Uh, and that's just what I did. So I'm going to start with one that's made out of two horseshoes and some chain. I first saw one of these. My parents went on a trip when I was young and they brought me back a uh, puzzle that was just like this when they, uh, when they came home and I thought it was the coolest thing. And since then I've made several with uh, different scout troops or others. It's great because it just takes a few basic materials and uh, not a lot of welding time. So it's pretty easy to put together. So to make this all you need are two horseshoes. I used pony shoes on this, so smaller smaller horseshoes. I don't know a lot about horseshoes, but uh, anyway, I think they're for ponies. And then um, a few links of chain and a uh, ring. And I picked up all this at the local farm store. So the, the idea here is you have to get the ring off of the horseshoes here. And uh, it is possible, you'll see in a minute. So first of all, uh, I took the chain and I got chain with small links and I use five links of chain. I've seen these that use three links of chain with a little bigger chain before, so they're kind of a little closer together. But I think with five links, it's a little bit more difficult. And so that makes it kind of funner. So you cut five links just like that and uh, put them together. And then you simply weld them to the horseshoes like this. So you connect the two ends of the horseshoes right there and tackle them together. And then to put the ring on, um, you take and you fold it like a book, slide the ring on, and then slide the two side to side, and it's on there. And then, you know, you leave it to somebody to figure out how to get off. And my teaser puzzles are pretty fun because you can watch people struggle through it, and then you can feel smart when you show them the solution, uh, even if you it on the internet. The next one I made is, is pretty fun. It's this little, uh, bolt and uh, washer and so you have a nut welded on the end of the bolt here and you have to get this lock washer off and it has a slot here in the head of the bolt so let's go ahead and get started with that all it is is a bolt and nut uh, of the same size and a lock washer that fits on them so pretty simple materials cheap and easy so the first thing uh, to do is just take and you cut the bolt off um, about the length that the, the nut is uh, thick right here. So you, you cut that off, you can use a cutoff wheel, I use the bandsaw, just about anything to cut that off. And then um, next you simply take the uh, cutoff piece and thread it into the nut uh, about one turn and put it down and tack weld it in place in a couple of spots, right? And so it, uh, you know, when you put it all together, it appears that the nut is welded on the whole bolt. Uh, here. Then um, to create kind of an illusion uh, that you can get the get the washer off through the head of the bolt, um, you take and put it in a vise and just cut a slot and you just cut it between uh, two corners uh, just like you can see there of the of the bolt. And so I had to take two passes with the cutoff wheel to make a slot that looked like it was wide enough you could get the lock washer off. So. Um, the lock washer, as it sits, isn't really uh, going to appear like it could come off through the slot, so you've got to take that. I put it in a vise and just bent it around to open it up a little bit, so it looks like it might come off through that slot. So um, and that's what I, uh, I did there, so, so it's pretty fun. I mean, uh, putting it together, you just slide the, slide the washer on and uh, thread the little cap that you made on there, and you can snug it up a little bit and so when you get it you know the the idea is you look at it and it looks like the nuts welded on and um, you see the slot so you think you've got to do something with that but uh, in reality um, you can just uh, unscrew it right off of here so video and I'd love if you subscribe to join me on uh, future videos and we'll see you next time